What is going on, everybody? Drama. We all love drama, am I right? So I decided to react to some of the exploit drama that has occurred in Lost Ark. And so for people who don't know what's going on, I'm going to tell you. And we're going to be looking at some Reddit posts. So I just picked all the top Reddit posts that were uh, posted today and I wanted to react to them. So some history. There is an exploit that's going on where you can claim Ignite server boxes in the legacy server. So what does this mean? This means that you get all those juiced mats, those fusion materials, those silver, bound gold, everything. You get them all claimed on your legacy character. And the insane part is that it is unlimited. You can do this every single time and abuse it. And apparently, based on what I've read, there are people doing this seven to eight hours every single day. They have a ton of resources and we'll be able to see some of it uh, visually. Okay, but anyway, let's start with this one. So, and if you guys didn't know, 10 days ago, this person, Redo, actually reported this. I got mats from the Ignite Server Express event on my main account. I'm pretty sure this is some kind of bug and don't want to get in any trouble. So this is an honest player who realized that he redeemed this chest, this transfer gift, I'm assuming, from the Ignite servers to the legacy server. And this was definitely a bug. This was 10 days ago. So we've known about this exploit since 10 days ago. And people have been picking up on it and have been abusing it since 10 days ago. And they've amassed a ton of resources. Spoiler for that. Uh, but yeah, see, there's comments similar to that. I can't believe it, even though they knew about the bug. They didn't do anything to fix it 10 days ago. I can't. Exactly. Some, of, some incompetency that I'm seeing here. But let's move on to the second post to see a little bit more deep dive. So here's everyone. So this is a meme. But honestly, this is kind of true. So if you see a bunch of people walking around with six pieces that are all 100 quality taps you know that they use the exploit it's a clear sign right this is really hard to get unless you're zeals <laughs> but yeah if you're just a regular player even a whale this is extremely hard to get so apparently there are a lot of players who since you get a lot of quality taps from those boxes they were able to infinitely tap their quality enough so that they could get a hundred quality on everything this is ridiculous moving on now let's talk about the community reaction so apparently more excited about the exploit consequences than a gear release is what someone posted i can't wait for ags to release the news on whatever they think is the reasonable consequence for abusing this exploit this is clearly breaking TOS, whatever the decision may be. They will definitely lose players on both sides. So this is an interesting point, right? So what does he exactly mean by this? And actually, this next post kind of dives into that, right? Because there's going to be two sides of things. Either AGS does something about it or they don't do anything. About it. If they do something about it, then most likely those players who have abused the exploit will get banned. That will make us lose players in Lost Ark. That is a bad thing. On the other hand, if AGS does not do anything, then what is that community going to do, right? Non-exploiters, if punishment seems unfair, or exploiters who will get banned, please AGS do the right thing. So let's see what the non-exploiters, if punishments are not happening, what are they going to do? So let's see. Two AGS. I'm sure I speak for many players like myself. If appropriate measures are not taken to address the recent exploiting, I will quit the game. Huh. Interesting. He is a day one player with nearly 5,000 hours who has never RMT'd, exploited, chaos botted, etc. And I've spent a few hundred bucks on the game. But he's a legitimate player who actually supported the game. If an appropriate response is not given out due to Ignite exploits, I'm quitting the game. 
Now, I don't know if he's serious or not, but let's just take it as serious, right? He goes on to say, this will have effectively devalued all the time I've put into the game because now assuming the worst thing that happens is minus gold and no rollback, the players who exploit it will have infinite tier four mats for the rest of time, plus a roster full of 1680 plus characters. The worst offenders will get around minus gold as they always do. So let's see how people comment to this. At first, I thought this was kind of melodramatic, but then I thought about it a bit, and I guess I have to agree with you. I don't think any action needs to be taken for someone who got one box if they only exploited it one time, similar to the guy uh, over here, right? He's a he's an innocent player. Then that makes it, oh, that, that's the next one. Uh, so some, some people are saying that, yes, it seemed like an overreaction in the beginning to just say that you would quit the game because of this, but it sort of makes sense because all of your progress just seems like nothing right the hundreds of dollars that he spent into the game now is nothing there's plenty of people who have done nothing but have used the exploits to get multiple 1680 plus characters this is infuriating i'm sure so this is what this guy was saying where either you will lose players by giving a punishment or you'll lose players because you didn't give a punishment Either way, I feel like Aegis will lose, and this is very, very upsetting, right? I mean, let's be honest. This exploit shouldn't have existed in the first place, correct? But then also, people shouldn't have abused it. I've said this on my stream multiple times because I've had tons of people asking me what I thought about the exploit, and we were talking about the exploits in whole, and I said that this was stupid because Aegis, I believe, is going to do something. They have to, right? No doubt about it. Now, what the punishment is going to be is a topic that we could discuss, but I do think they'll do something, and most likely, we will lose players, unfortunately. But do we really want those players in the first place? There's an argument for that, too. So, I don't know. Maybe we should bring in an influx of better new players into this game and kick those exploiters out. Uh, let's see if anybody else is thinking the same thing. Okay, see, he's saying also, I 100% second you, and a lot of people agree with me as well. If no serious action is taken, it's over. Okay, it seems like the community's opinions are pretty similar. There's two sides of everything, and I've actually seen Reddit posts of people defending the exploits. I didn't, I can't, I don't have anything in here, but there are people that have defended it. And personally, I think those are people who have actually did the exploits and are nervous about the punishment. But that's besides the point. Okay, now we can visually see what the results of that exploit was. So I, I don't know about this one. Your account has been suspended for two weeks. But this seems pretty reasonable, right? Pushing to 1715, having millions of gold, having 100 quality on all of your gear having infinite shards infinite silver these are all rewards that were given in that ignite server box so it makes sense that people have a ton of them that have exploited it but finally we have a somewhat of a conclusion this is getting spicy any news so this person evangelion zero no idea who he is but he says Everyone's gonna get banned. Relax. I'm speaking with Henry right now. I'm serious. So we don't know what exactly is happening, but apparently they are thinking about banning them. That's a big deal. The big B. So will they actually ban or not? Time will tell. We don't know. But I thought this drama was quite interesting and I wanted to catch anyone up that wasn't aware of any of this didn't read reddit or you know they actually did the bug and didn't realize it watch out because hey you might be getting banned anyways that's my reaction thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next video goodbye